Hello, Cole McTavish, French immersion parents and families. I just wanted to go over a little bit about high school pass for French immersion students. Uh, we are going to cover what's on the screen here. Uh, the first one being the French language arts courses in high school, and I'll talk a little bit about it to sell and then French, math, and science as well at the end. The first one, uh, you're going to see a, very, a lot of similarities. If you've watched the English uh, and social studies video, they're identical, except these are now in French. So this is your fifth core course is your FLA. Uh, to get your bilingual diploma, you must have two courses in the French languages through your high school years. Uh, that's for the excellence diploma. Uh, you make sure you get these done. One must be French language arts. So if you finish French language arts 9, uh, you will continue on through to French language arts 10-1. And um, if you have over 65, we hope we, we know you will do better in that French language arts 10-1 stream. Uh, if you got less than that, but above 50, then it'd be that French language arts 10-2. Normally these will happen in the same classroom because the numbers are a bit lower. Um, it's just a difference in the marking by the teachers. We're very experienced at that, so they know how to how to do that properly. Uh, after grade 10, you will go on to the 20-1 or 20-2. Uh, of course, remembering that these percentages that we're saying to move on are suggested. We know you'll be most successful if you get over 65 to stay in that dash one stream. But as long as you pass, you can continue. You can also choose if you've done French 10-1 and got a mark that's less than 60, well, maybe I should get into dash two because I don't really need dash one anyways. So then you continue on to grade 12 and, and have that route. You can even take 30-2 through it and then take an extra semester of the dash one uh, to finish it at the end as well is another route to go. So very similar to the English language arts, but this is for our French students and only for you guys. And then social studies you will see is very similar as well. So this is HSL in high school, uh, same as the social studies in English, but it is in the French programming. So you have your social studies nine on the one side. If you got over 65, you go to the 10-1, and then you can continue across uh, in the dash one programming with the 65s. And then if you're in the 50s to 60 range, the dash two could be a stronger place. While the 10-4 the, uh, does exist, we haven't offered it here, so we would have to meet with you to discuss that. Um, so the 10-1 and 10-2 social studies, once again, must go all the way across. This is normally the two classes. If students are looking for that bilingual diploma, uh, we'll take these two all the way through. Now, having said that, though, we do also offer, uh, when the numbers warrant, uh, math classes. So we have math 10C in French. This is the English uh, page, but it does work the exact same in French. So as our interest is there for our students, we will offer these programs in uh, French as well. So Math 10C this, this year was offered in French, and that will continue across as long as the students are there for the interest level. Um, as it gets higher, less kids tend, students tend to take the, these courses in French, but we are going to offer it if the interest is there. So that will continue. The same will go for science. Uh, we have Science 10 in French. Uh, and then many students choose to go into the English versions, these biophysics and chemistry. But if the interest is there to run them in French and biology, physics, chemie, then we will do that as well. Uh, so it's really your students' desire to continue into which ones they want. As I mentioned, this is the English screen, but these courses can all be offered in French as well. So that's the way French immersion works for high school. So the most important thing to remember is that you need to have two courses all the way through to get that bilingual certificate at the end. Um, and then also Albert Ed issues an, a bilingual diploma at the end uh, to you via the mail. So there's two things that you can be going for. So it's uh, excellent programming that can continue all the way to grade 12. So if that is what interests you, make sure that you sign up for these when you're registering. Thank you very much for your time. If you have more questions, make sure you ask them uh, and take a look at the other videos on how to register.